Hey, thanks for checking in on Bathtub Sir, and I'm currently in the tub with Donut County. And from the looks of things, this seems like the sort of place I'm gonna live. Look, there's a huge donut, there's a raccoon, and I think there's construction horses down the bottom there. It seems really serene, and there's some lovely music. So this game was released on the 28th of August 2018, and it's currently priced at £10.29. Now, Donut County was made by a gentleman called Ben Esposito, and it's published by Annapurna Interactive. Now, these two have a relationship because Annapurna published games such as What Remains of Edith, uh, Edith Finch and also The Unfinished Swan, I believe. And I think Mr. Esposito had a hand in both of them games. Never played Edith Finch, but I did play The Unfinished Swan and thought it was a very unique, fun game. So, I'm hopeful for Donut County. Uh, so, you might be asking, what the hell is Donut County? Are we a donut? Are we a county? No, we're a hole. We're a huge hole. The game's premise is just absurd. You play a big hole that swallows things up and that's your main aim. But I think coupled with a lovely style and some uh, some really good, uh, well-written humour, this game is just a delight to play. Well, we hope it is anyway. So let's jump in and get our hole on. Mirror's house. Do we have to do anything to get inside Mirror's house? Do we knock once? Do we barge in through the window? Oh, shit, okay, so we're playing. Um, okay, so, there's a, is that a cat on a motorbike? Let's knock on the door. Ben Esposito presents. Oh, fuck me. Mira, when are you coming into work? I'm bored. <laughs> okay, so this is like a, a raccoon with a bandana around his neck. Oh my god, we're not like to pass him in the dark alley. He looks like a thug. What does that sign mean, do you reckon? I'll reply. Quiet, BK. Okay, so the raccoon's called BK, we're called Mira. I'm dead. I've died. Please have some respect. <laughs> Lol, why are you dead? The honking man woke me up again. At the honk of dawn. Honking unbelievable. Don't worry. I'll revenge you. These characters remind me of the characters at Night in, uh, in the Woods. Be careful, dude. This guy really honks. Yeah, whatever. Come to the donut shop and stop feeding your dog bread. How does he know? He needs to. He needs bread to live, BK. I'm gonna press this. Oh, we sent an emoji. <laughs> oh, awesome. Okay. He's a certified loaf. Okay, I'm leaving in five minutes. Bye. Okay, nice. So do we pull the blind? Yeah, I think so. I drag it. Or do I raise it? I'll put it to the right. You can see I've never handled blinds before. There's the honking fucker. And there's the donuts. So, yeah, will you fall down? Oh, you will. I think our hole's getting bigger. <laughs> Where did the hole come from? <laughs> we were just on about going to meet the raccoon at the, bur at the donut shop. And now this has happened? Oh, we can even eat the grass. Are we eating? I don't know, just consume. Take that. This is like that flash game I used to play when I was bored at school when you're like a fish in a pond oh, and you're not getting away that easily. And he dropped his donuts. Oh, I love the physics in this. <laughs> so we need to get big enough to get him before he gets away. <laughs> oh, it's morbid. Where's he falling to? Will he ever come out again? Has he got a family? But yeah, this flash game, you ever played it? You're like a fish and you need to eat the fish food. But if you touch bigger fish, you die. Come on. Get in here. We'll eat the fence as well. Oh, he fit in. He's gone. Holy crap. Never to be seen again. I think we just effectively killed a man. We'll get over it. So now we're at the donut shop. Oh, I love BK. <laughs> Look at this dude. Dude, the honking stops. Did you actually just do something to the honking man? Yeah, don't worry about him. I just delivered him a donut. Um, okay, lol. Well, I guess it distracted him. Hey, guess what? I'm level 9 now. Wow. Cool. You don't get it, Mira. At level 10, I own my quadcopter. Alright, oh, sick. Congrats. We're gonna buzz around like kings. <laughs> okay, see you soon, BK. 
Oh, the soundtrack's amazing this as well. Six weeks later, we gotta face repercussions of the murder we committed. <gasps> Mira, how? Oh, is that the copter? <laughs> how could you smash my quadcopter? Who cares about your stupid quadcopter? How could you destroy the entire town? 999 feet below, Donut County. Holy crap, things got out of hand. Terribly. Look at them all sitting around the campfire. <laughs> this is not the story I was expecting from this. In fact, I didn't know what to expect. But it's lovely and quirky. I've never destroyed anything. I'm kind. Oh my god, what? You used that stupid app to open up holes all over town. And now we're all stuck underground. Everything here looks fine to me. Except my quadcopter. I'm the victim. Will someone back me up here? BK, it's obvious that you did it. I got swallowed by a hole right after I ordered a donut from your shop. What does that have to do with Mira smashing my quadcopter? Potter, what happened to your son? Oh, pup. My sweet puppin' boy. He must still be up there some somewhere. Potter's Rock. Okay, press A button to deploy the hole. So what, we're going to find her son and bring him down to us? 5 or 9 p.m. Oh, I'm guessing this is BK's phone screen. Because he still uses an app to make the holes. <laughs> deploy the hole. We'll take that piece of paper, thank you. And maybe that rock? No, you're too big. But there's more paper around here. And now we're big enough for that rock. Oh, crap. Shit, look, it's too horizontal. It's not going to fall into us. Okay, I wonder if there's ways, if there's fail conditions for this and you've got to restart. Oh, we got the box though. Isn't this just the weirdest but most brilliant game you've played? <laughs> there we go, perfect. I'm loving how it's using physics here. And I'm loving how it's just made like a bat shit backbone out of a, a, a premise that really didn't need one. I would happy to just say, alright, we're a hole, let's um, engorge stuff. But no, we got, we got, uh, we're invested in this now. <laughs> I love BK and Mira. Can we take that? Okay, we've got the skull. Now we've got the case. Now for the final box. Beautiful. So do we move on? That must be Potter's son. Let's go for the dog bow and the bone. And the brick. Oh, we're out of the fence. I'm guessing if he's a smart pup, he might shut the door when we get close. I mean, it's just blowing my mind that everything can fall into this hole. And it's really satisfying. <laughs> just to watch these things drop in. Okay, no, the wall is a barrier. So will you let us in? I thought you might do that. No problem. We're a sneak. Oh, there's Mrs. Potter. Maybe this is going back in time then. Back in time to when she first fell down. Holy shit, that sound track. I would listen to this on every commute. Oh, she's uh, <laughs> she's making clay, molding clay. Lovely. So instead of like uh, the ghost of Patrick Swayze coming up behind her, it's going to be a huge hole. Let me just get that. She hasn't noticed anything yet. Take that. Can we move on a bit? No, we need to get her. It looks sinister. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, did you see that? That must be quite traumatising for a son to see that. Don't worry, she's fine. Take this. There we go. Yeah, don't think these pots are all getting away. I'm going to destroy her life's work. In you get. Feed the hole. <laughs> Beautiful. They smash as well. Seriously, I'm having far too much fun here. I feel like a psychopath. But no one can stop me. Destroy it all. Destruction is so fun to just play in games, isn't it? I might just make it all fall and then clean it up. <laughs> okay, now. Are we going to be able to get this in? Oh, look at that. Of course we can. Now what's this going on here? There's a hot air balloon, I think? We didn't go for the sun. Can live another day. Oh, he's trying to get away. Okay, he's a hot air balloon and there's a furnace fire there. So what, what are you saying here? He needs, oh, let's see this over here. Does he need smoke? Does he need like a, a downward thrust of air to get going? And maybe break them constraints? 
Holy shit. Okay, awesome. So we're interacting with the environment. This beautiful hole. Up you go, doggy. So that's how he escapes. He's floating now. Endlessly. It's terrifying. Pups Odyssey. Off you go, buddy. Oh, now we can eat his home, maybe. Get in here. <laughs> Holy crap, it's getting gargantuan. It's terrifying, really. I'd love to see a thriller based on his premise. Maybe starring Kevin Bacon and set, I don't know, 20 years ago. What else can we get? The fence. And this bit of rock. Yes, say goodbye to these beautiful canyon looking rock. Now the home. Can't eat the home yet. Oh, maybe we can. In you get. <laughs> beautiful stuff. It really is. It's art. Great delivery. Ooh. Oh, yeah, because BK wants to get to rank 10 for the copter. I get it. Trasho Trashopedia? Okay. What the hell? It's going to give us little tidbits about every item we swallowed. Barrel cactus. You may think there's loot inside because it says barrel. But it's full of spiders. Oh, fuck that. It's a free house. Don't let it get wet. <laughs> the cave. Go in here if you want to get yelled at by coyotes. Oh, I'm going to read all of these. Coffee rules. It burns your tongue and makes you go to the bathroom. Protects you from cows? <laughs> Do not try to wash cotton candy in the pool. This tip will save your life. Oh, these are brilliant. You can make your own bones at home. Oh, I need to stop because I'll just spend the whole episode reading these. But I love them. Drinking from this is like kissing a dog, but not as fun. <laughs> oh, speak for yourself. Right, okay, we're done. I need to get back in that trashopedia. Have a garbage day. Right, this is a gem. This game is an absolute gem. So now we're going to speak to the next victim, I guess. Could it be that crocodile? Was that a frog with an afro? I just wanted to surprise pup with a donut. Now he's floating away, a lone pup. No, he's not. If you got swallowed first, how do you know pup is in the balloon? This story is full of holes. Your brain is full of holes. And so is the entire town, thanks to you. Just doing my job. Wait, I mean, not true. I'm innocent. Wait, the pup is in a hot air balloon? I saw a hot air balloon float by my ranger station. You saw pup? Which way was he heading? I don't know, I I got distracted. I just ordered a donut. Nice. I get hungry when I'm anxious, lol. Anxious about what? Believe it or not, snakes. So now we meet how Helen met her demise into the whole ranger station. Let's do it. Are we gonna swallow some snakes here? Oh yeah, wait, are they are they are snakes? Okay, cool. I thought they were diglets. Oh shit! <laughs> the snake won't get in. Come on. There he goes. He's crawled in. So really we're doing Helen a favour. It's like the snake whacking festival in Springfield, but with holes this time. So does that mean there's holes all underneath where we're sitting around the campfire? Oh fuck me! It's like them joke snakes you can get, and they just like they're spring loaded. <laughs> and fire out to anyone with a huge phobia. Don't do that, it's cruel. Okay, take that and that and that. We should be able to eat snakes in one now. I say eat. Consume is, is better. Oh, napping on a rock are you snake? Not anymore. Oh that's an easy one. Then we'll leave this uh rattly boy till last. Oh, I love how they spring up, but they don't save them. Oh, you can see BK in the top left corner on his tablet. <laughs> Playing his app right now. What's going on with them buttons? Is it like an alarm? There's a big snake in a cage there. So there is like slight puzzle elements to it as well. I mean, the, the only puzzle element we, you can argue we've seen right now is the hot air balloon. And that was very easy to, to, to suss. But you're hoping as the game progresses, you could really have some head scratches here. I would love it. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Snake danger. Gone to amber. So what do we do if it's pointy tail? <laughs> what? Do we free the chickens? I think we need to free the chickens somehow. And that raises the level of snake danger. Snake danger is no joke. 
It's even worse than Stranger Danger. Do not open your door to a snake. Now we're talking. What is he going to unleash? Oh, we got this side to whack. So we go round and round. Make the, the chicken dizzy. Oh, there we go. That way. It's just a screw. <laughs> makes no sense and I love it. Holy shit. Look at all them damn snakes. Helen's going to be petrified. Get in here, boys. You scaly bastards. Don't forget the chickens. Wait, do you reckon the snakes will eat the chickens down there? Maybe the chickens could even eat the snakes. Eat all this. Then don't worry, Helen. We're coming for you. You will join your friends and foes. Get in here, alarm system cave. Ooh. Do I ever feel bad about this, you might be wondering? The answer is no. In fact, I thrive off this. If I could do this all day every day, I would see my life as complete. <laughs> this is so fun, watching the hole get incrementally bigger, so we can fit more things in. <laughs> and that is how Helen ended up here. Great delivery, thank you. Oh, I've got this kick-ass music now. Yeah, Trashopedia. What are you saying, chicken? It's one thing to own a chicken, but two chickens? That's two things. <laughs> it's so stupid. Oh, they're, they're way better than dad jokes, but they, some, they're written just the same. A large mug for dirt lovers. You're always on the wrong side of it, the wooden fence. Okay, grass is always greener, holes always bigger. Is there a snake? A live spaghetti. Perfect. Oh, another snake. Cool snake. A live spaghetti with the ability to hate. <laughs> and that's what makes him cool, because he can be edgy. Right, I think we've got to see one more scenario here. I'm having too much fun. I'm going to see who, uh, who else is going to pipe up around the campfire. BK is really dodging blame here, but I, I think I agree it's always fault. LOL! Sounds like you should be thanking me for solving your snake problem. Wait. So it was you who opened up the holes. What? No. I'm just saying, whoever did do it was totally doing you a solid. He's probably a really cool and nice guy. Hmm. Did anyone else see Pup? Yep. I saw Pup. With my telescope. You mean my telescope? That's what I said. My telescope. Where did you see him? Well, me and Pepper were feuding again, so I moved my trailer to Mint River. He took a liking to this bird! <laughs> yep. A bird made for liking. I was admiring this bird. Till I was hit with a hunger. So I ordered a donut by way of this donut county app. Then the hole came. Yeah, I'm seeing the link between the ordering of donuts and holes. Riverbed, yes, that dog is ours. That little pug. But first we'll go for the fish. Oh, we got a tiny hole. Start with the stones. Don't worry, tiny hole. You'll be a grown-up one day. And you can do whatever you like until you get old enough to realise you're not as special as you once thought and your ambition can easily get waysided by the harsh realities of life. Such as working menial jobs just to make ends meet. Okay, let's stay with the hole. Oh, he's littering. We've got to clean up that litter. Take the bucket. Did he hide? He can't. Oh, <laughs> let's move over here. <gasps> we can get the water. No way. We're a water hole now. And it makes things float. Okay, how do we empty? We can save the fish. Oh, I want to get rid of the water. What else if we put this in there? Nothing. Oh, do we need to move it over somehow? Shit, we could be a little bit stuck here. How about this uh, this bird? Yeah, you want to... Oh, you get rid of the water. Okay, awesome. Thank you. So if we get fill up, you'll just drink it. Perfect. Go on, get in, get in. Oh, wiggling does help. Perfect. So, you want to drain up everything, really. Thank you. Make it all dry. And then we should be big enough to let him fall in. Oh, this soundtrack. My god, it's so good. Like, I'm, I feel like I'm listening to lo-fi relaxing beats to study and revise to. But instead of playing Donut County, it's amazing. Get it. 
could we be big enough for him now? I think we are. Oh shit, we've knocked him about a bit. No, not quite. Get in here, please. A tennis ball came out. <laughs> okay, you probably got to get rid of all the water to be big enough. That'll make the most sense. So I may as well just do it. Got a red tray. Last little bit. I'll go back for that fish. Don't you worry. Think you're getting away. You damn gills. Now should we eat the bird? No. Oh, look. Very clever. There's pegs going down. He's in. Now what? What are we missing? Oh, <laughs> now the bird drops. <laughs> Welcome. What's your name? Was it Pepper or something? Still quite a ways off from rank 10 though. It's in the Trashopedia. Portable outhouse. Salt, oh, his name was Salt, not Pepper. Oh, his wife was Pepper, right? Ukulele piece. Half of a mouse guitar. Has the word forever carved into it. And one more. Fast food tray. Free sled. Oh, it said free salad. Does that, that doesn't make sense. Okay, let's go back to the gang. Get out of here. 999 feet below. Do we recognise any of the surroundings now? Okay, right, and as lovely <laughs> as, as much as I want to hear what BK's going to say, I'm going to leave it there. I think I've given you a good enough impression of what this game is all about. And my god, it's fucking brilliant. It's an amazing game. Um, I'm surprised more people aren't talking about this, or maybe they are. I, I don't keep my ear too close to the grounds, um, because I'm a dope, I guess. But Donut County is really cool. Really, really cool. I've loved every second of there. Pure joy uh, for each moment. Definitely recommend you pick this up. I have no idea how long the game was, um, but I feel like I've got a good value for £10 already because you can only assume you're going to get to level 10 uh, and the XP bar is not even halfway yet. So if you enjoyed this episode of In The Tub With, please go ahead and leave a like. It helps out a great deal and I really do appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed this one as much as I have. And if you want to see more, we do In The Tubs With every Monday. We also do Let's Plays on the channel and we live stream twice a week. There is tons of content here for you. I'd be honoured if you could go ahead and subscribe. Got any questions you want to raise? Have you played Donut County yourself? I'd love to hear your thoughts on this. Do you find it as charming as I do? Please let me know in the comments below and I will make sure I get back to you. Alright, see you!